In this video, we'll write the balanced net ionic equation for FeCl2 plus Zn. This is iron 2 chloride plus zinc. The first thing we need to do with net ionic equations, we need to balance the molecular equation. And this is our molecular equation. The good thing is this is already balanced, so we don't have to do much there. Next, we can write the states for each substance. If you know your solubility rules, compounds with chlorine, they're very soluble, AQ. Then zinc, that's just a zinc metal, so that's a solid. Iron, that's just iron metal, a solid. And then again, another chloride, so very soluble, aqueous, dissolves, dissociates into its ions. Next, we can split the strong electrolytes into their ions for the complete ionic equation. We don't know the charge on iron just looking at it, but we do know the chloride ion is 1 minus. Since we have two of them, that's 2 minus. This has to be 2 plus. So we'll have our iron 2 ion, Fe2 plus. I won't write the states now. Let's do that later. Plus, we have these two chloride ions. So we'll have 2 Cl minus. Then we'll have our zinc. We can't really do much with that. That's just zinc. And these are the reactants in our net ionic equation. For the products, we have iron. That's just Fe plus. Zinc is always 2 plus. And the chloride ion, that's going to be 1 minus. So we have our zinc ion, Zn2 plus. And then we have two of those chloride ions, just like we have in the reactants. So this is the complete ionic equation. Now we can cross out the spectator ions. They're on both sides. So I have my reactants and my products. The only thing that's the same are these two chloride ions right here. These are spectator ions, and we can cross these spectator ions out like that. And that gives us the net ionic equation for FeCl2 plus Zn. I'll clean this up and write the states. We'll have our net ionic equation. So this is the balanced net ionic equation for iron 2 chloride plus zinc. We have our charge balanced. We have a 2 plus here on the reactant side. And then on the products, there's a 2 plus charge. So charge is balanced. If you count the atoms up, they're balanced as well. This is Dr. B with the balanced net ionic equation for FeCl2 plus Zn. Thanks for watching.